history of a bigger mystery. I have written this story into my song. If it isn't what you used to, I hope it will amuse you. And maybe if you choose to, then you'll sing along. It goes, I am as old as the universe. I've been here before and I'll be here again. I am a child of the universe, a part of all women and a part of all men. Once upon a sometime and once upon a somewhere, once upon a somehow there was a big bang. Evolving and energy dissolving, energy revolving, and that's what I am. I am as old as the universe. I've been here before and I'll be here again. I am a child of the universe, a part of all women and a part of all. Just a little notion, a pattern in the potion, one ripple in the ocean, no purpose or plan. Suddenly I found me inside a little boundary with water all around me and my life began. I am as old as the universe. I've been here before and I'll be here again. I am cover back and we're ready to go. Up into the sunlight, out into the moonlight, give appetite a green light and watch the world grow. I am as old as the universe. I've been here before and I'll be here again. I am a child of the universe, a part of all a part of all men. I'm a little flower that blossoms for an hour, but in me there's a power that grows on and on. Power at the root of me, power in the shoots of me, power in the fruit that will pass my seed on. I am as old as the universe. somebody. I am not a nobody. I am a cell in one body, filling all space. All I ever could be, and all I ever should be, and all I ever will be, is here in this place. I am as old as the universe. I've been here before, and I'll be here again. I am a child. So that was uh, Child of the Universe by Theo Simon from uh, the world's best environmental music group, in my opinion, called Seize the Day. You can see them on seizetheday.org. And uh, there's an interesting story that goes with this, that when I was uh, uh, started doing the cosmic walk ceremony with these candles, uh, um, a, a um, ritual uh, devised by Sister Miriam Therese McGillis, a Catholic nun from Genesis Farm in New Jersey and a colleague of uh, Thomas Berry's, I, I realised that this, the way that the song was originally written, uh, it would go from uh, Candle 1 
to uh, candle 17 uh, flowers and there was too big a break in between so I wrote to Theo and said, uh, told him my problem and uh, said would it be possible for him to uh, write a couple of more verses for the song, one uh, for um, one for the first cell of life, candle seven, and one for life emerges from the ocean, candle fifteen. Uh, but I, in case he didn't feel like doing that, I'd be happy to try and write those verses myself. So he replied, saying, uh, "Sure, he'd be happy to. He'd be happy to write the write the verses." But the next day, I got an email from him saying that uh, he and uh, Shannon were pregnant and that he couldn't do any more free, uh, free work, that he'd have to charge for the work that he did. And so I said, uh, that seemed fair enough, and how much would he charge me for two verses for Child of the Universe? And he said, 50 quid, and I said, fine. So uh, I'm proud to have uh, uh, been the sort of uh, the Medici that uh, um, commissioned uh, this great composer to write uh, two more verses for his song. And uh, so beautiful to have had a chance to um, do the uh, Cosmic Walk and Child of the Universe here at Moon Court. Has Moon Court got a, um, a website? <laughs> Oh, well, pegiron.org. Yeah, of course. So, so, so we'll put that link, and we'll put, yeah. Uh, yeah. and we'll put the cosmic walk link. Yeah, on the, yeah, on the, and, on and there is a direct link to the Moon Court story.